There is now an AI that doesn't just generate images, but actually thinks like a professional designer. Meet Lover, the world's first design agent that literally changes everything. Luckily, I've been invited to test this revolutionary application, and this is honestly about to change how we create things. And I want you guys to understand that this isn't just another AI image generator. This is a really comprehensive system that can replace your entire marketing team. So let me actually show you guys exactly what this can do. And a quick note, if you're wondering if it includes the state-of-the-art models, it literally has all of the state-of-the-art models in one place. It has GPT Image 1, Flux Pro, Gemini's new image model, Kling AI, Hilu AI, Recraft AI, Runway AI, Idagram, literally all of them you can access without ever leaving the platform. So let's actually start with our first project. So what I want to do is actually want to generate some marketing materials with my logo. So that's what I'm going to go ahead and do. So what I've actually asked it to do here is to generate me a set of AI posters for the AI Grid Film Festival, make it black and dark purple theme and use the logo. And what's really cool about this is you can actually see how the AI is reasoning about your design choices. And it's super, super quick. Let me show you guys what it made. And what I really like about this as well is that you actually get some direction choices. So here it's giving me four quick direction choices. Direction one, a neon grid burst. Direction two, quantum lens. Direction three, a glitch college or direction four, a synth wave skyline. I think I like direction two. So here we can see it actually has the perfect theme for me. If you've ever seen my brand on YouTube, you'll know that the main focus is this kind of purple slash dark black theme. And I think these look absolutely amazing. So the only thing I could do here is some small changes. Now, full disclosure, there isn't an AI grid film festival. That would be really cool. But I'm just designing these to show you guys just how cool this really is. So what I could do now to make this even more better is I can now change certain things. So let me show you guys the tab feature, human and AI, one canvas, click on any area, type your edit in natural language, and the love art design agent is going to handle the rest. So for example, I love this one right here. It looks so professional. If I was hosting a film festival, I would love to put this poster out. And what I could do is I could say, make the background have purple digital grid with glowing lines. And so I'm just going to click enter there. And now it's going to get started to make an iteration. And so right here, you can see it literally adds the perfect changes. Before here, the old version was a little bit bland, but with a few input words with our text prompts, we can literally improve the quality of this so much. That's why I love this platform because the canvas allows you to design in a way that is fluid and intuitive. Now, of course, if we ever want to download these images, we just click the export button and we can download an SVG. PNG or JPEG, which is super useful because it allows us to access all formats. So now you just witnessed how my agent was able to create me a set of different marketing materials for my AI film festival. We just saw that the AI agent reasoned through multiple steps, gave me an option, and what was incredible that it literally gave me an entire canvas with multiple options and with the tab feature, I was able to quickly make some changes. But now I'm gonna show you guys how we can take this to the next level. Let's say I want more marketing materials, but I'm a little short on ideas. Let's go back over to our design agent and let's start brainstorming so that I can hype up a product release. Now what's great about this is that there are actually multiple style references here. So you can see here that once I press this tab, it opens up to multiple different style references that is great for me because I don't know where I even want to begin. So now I can scroll down and add this cyber blue here, which is a style, which is really cool. Now I'm going to add some details about this brainstorm that are going to really help me when it comes to marketing materials for a video trailer that I want to make when I release a product. So let me start with some ideas I could potentially use. I've also now uploaded my image and let me enter the design requirements. I've said here, create an idea for the first opening shot of a trailer of a cinematic AI newsletter launch. I've said here, Ensure that it stays on brand, which is dark black, neon purple, and epic slash esoteric. Now what my design agent is going to do, it's going to reason about everything, and then I'm going to get the result. And once again, the task has been completed. Let me close this, and I'll show you guys exactly what it's done. So it's given me four options here, and it's absolutely incredible. I would argue that this one right here just tops off the mark because it takes my logo completely and it adds this neon area underneath the logo that just makes it pop in a brighter way. If you also take a look at the entire canvas now, you're starting to understand why this platform is much better than just using ChatGPT. You're able to brainstorm and get multiple different things all at once in a much more effective way. So now what I can do, remember how I said that I wanted to make this a video? I can literally turn this into a video almost immediately. No switching, no having to upload this to another external video platform. 
just one simple prompt. And so now we can see right here, it actually managed to make this video within a few seconds. It's absolutely crazy. Now remember guys, this is just my use case because I'm someone that works in AI and making videos. If you actually check out the homepage and you scroll down, you'll see tons and tons of different creative use cases. Honestly, I'm pretty sure that most of you guys would probably benefit from using this software for whatever business you're working on. I know that this is going to be my go-to workplace anytime I need a design. Another key feature I really love about this platform is the fact that it has this tune feature. So we all know that AI images are generative, meaning that they're never going to be super perfect. But Love Art essentially has this thing called tune. That just means we've got a limitless canvas with effortless editing. We can select any layer and we can tune it with smart tools. The size, the fonts, the colors are all done in one canvas. For example, let's say I really like this image. I can go ahead and I can smudge certain things. For example, let's say I wanted to change this so that things are a little bit smudgy and a little bit more artistic. I can do that. I can tune the image to make sure it's perfect for me. Also, if I want, I can simply inpaint in other images. Let's say I just grab this right here. I can simply circle this. And let's say I want to add a black hole. Once I've clicked the in painted button, it's going to add that feature. And we can see here that I'm literally able to tune this image however I want. I can add a planet, I can add a black hole, all small details to make the images perfect for whatever it is that I want. Another use case that I actually asked Love Art to do was to actually create me a website that was for my newsletter. So if you guys don't know, I've recently started a newsletter where I send people weekly emails on the top AI stories. And I was wondering, could I get a design that actually looks pretty good? I input my logo in and I said, take my current logo and branding and turn it into a concept art for a newsletter landing page. Make it clean, minimal for those who want the latest AI news. It thought about it, done a lot of work. And what was really cool about this is that if I click preview HTML, I actually do get to view this website as is. So if I want iterations or anything like that, I could actually see exactly what the user sees. This was a really cool use case that most people probably wouldn't have discovered, but because I've used this platform for quite some time now, I think it's a really compelling use case. Now, additionally, because I want to kind of broaden my horizons, I decided to ask Love Art to create some merchandise ideas for my YouTube channel and based on my brand. And we can see here, it actually came up with a mascot and then put that mascot on a shirt on an iPhone and on the hat. So it was really, really cool because it decided to come up with this AI grid mascot first, and then it decided to continue to create multiple different variations and mock-ups so that I could see which one would probably be the best. I think for me, in terms of which one would probably be the best is the hat. I don't know why, but I just think that one looks the coolest and maybe even the shirt. But overall, I think this is another compelling use case if you want to potentially start your brand and have your brand on many different pieces of clothing. It's super useful for visualizing which pieces are gonna be the best. And as you guys know, I am an AI news channel and I tried to keep you guys up to date with all the AI news. And so I actually asked Love Art in this example to take the logo design and do a concept news post template for Instagram, do a pretend article of OpenAI achieving AGI, use my colors and branding. And basically what Love Art did was create four separate variations of news templates that I could potentially use for when I start my Instagram. So maybe if I wanna do news stories, I could do it like this. If I wanna do them, I could do it like this, or maybe I could do it like this. So either way, I think I probably would use this design. I'd have my logo up here, then I would have the breaking here. And this is what I could use to actually prototype social media designs. So this is something that's super, super useful. If you're trying to broaden your brand's social media reach, or even just your own social media reach with custom design posts. Brainstorming is a breeze here. So if you want to try this out, get yourself on the Love Art waitlist today by checking out loveart.ai. Explore loveart.ai and start vibe designing now.